Well, one of the best things you can do with mercury <laughs> is to see how it reacts with other things. Because on its own, it's this weird, mirrory, liquidy material. On here, I've got a cannonball, an iron cannonball. Now, this, this material is strangely attracted to the Earth with a large force. What is this? So this invisible force gravity pulls the cannonball straight down. Now, let's see how this cannonball reacts when I put it in mercury. Take this off. Hello, Mercury. Meet Cannonball. Whoa. Now that is very, very odd. Even something as heavy as a cannonball is bobbing around like it's a light float. That is how dense liquid mercury is. What an amazing substance. So, you can have incredibly dense liquids that can float cannonballs. And this material, now can you see it? It's almost not there. This is the lightest solid in the world. It's called aerogel. This is 99.8% air. It's a glass foam. And the size of the bubbles in the foam is so small, they scatter light in the same way that light is scattered in the sky. So it's only 2% solid, 0.2%. So this is, a, this, is, this is blue for the same reason the sky is blue, and it's almost completely air. So this is as close as you'll ever get to holding a piece of sky in your hand.